So. Hello everyone, it's Phil Jones for Projected Reviews and I am here with Kevin who is the yeah. CTO of Xgemi and you are showing a amazing new projector. So can you yes. talk a little bit about the Xgemi Horizon Max? Uh, no problem. Actually, um, we brings a uh, Horizon Max this year and uh, we brings our dual optic technologies which named uh, dual light to Dot o. Mm -hmm. And uh, what's the difference is that from the dual light dot o, uh, we use the RGB triple lasers mm -hmm. and uh, we use the uh, uh, phosphor light source and mm -hmm. combine them together. Mm -hmm. And uh, we do uh, um, high brightness and high contrast and high comfort. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we get the world first IMAX enhanced long throw smart projectors. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We've had the opportunity on project reviews to review a large range of Xemi projectors. Yes. And every single one has had very good design, excellent picture quality, and unique technologies. Yes. So, so for example, um, we had the opportunity to review the Horizon Ultra, yeah. which utilized the original dual light. And the goal of that was to give you the advantages of a three color light source without yes. some of the things that you would see like like speckle and color fringing. Yes. And, and that system originally was RGB LED yeah. with a red laser was that was that the original uh, you system? You mean the previous one? Right? Yeah, the original yeah. dual light. The original dual light uh, 1.0 we mm -hmm. use the uh, wide spectrum mm -hmm. such kind of uh, like uh, for instance the LED mm -hmm. light source right mm -hmm. and uh, combined with a narrow mm -hmm. spectrum mm -hmm. light source such mm -hmm. as laser mm -hmm. and we combine the LED and the lasers mm -hmm. to uh, get a uh, uh, high bright mm -hmm. and uh, uh, comfortable light source. Mm -hmm. uh, so that is the light so, uh, dual light 1.0. Mm -hmm. uh, but the bright is in, in not enough. So yeah. we bring the, the, uh, the new one. Yes. You guys are very good. Xgeam is very good at looking yeah. at ways to advance technologies when it, that are yeah. utilized in projectors. Yeah. A lot of companies are selling blue laser phosphor only. Yes. Or they'll go out and buy maybe a third party manufacturer's light source yeah. and try to utilize that. Yeah. The fact that you guys are always looking for new ways yeah. to develop new light sources is one of the reasons why your projections perform yes. so well. Yeah. Like for example, the Horizon Ultra, the, it, the, I was not only amazed with the, um, the, the amount of colors it can make, but how accurate the yeah. colors were. Yeah. But as you mentioned, um, an LED, can, LED light system can only go so far, yeah. which is why you went to the, 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 this, this new solution, yes. which still gives you, eliminates the, the color fringing yes. and, the, and the speckle, yeah. but gives you more brightness, yes. right? Yes. So let's talk a little bit about this. So now this is using three lasers yes. and a phosphor, because most of the time yes. you think about a, a three laser system, you don't need the phosphor. So why put the phosphor in? Okay, uh, that is a good question. Uh, because if we only use the RGB laser light source, right, mm -hmm. you know there is uh, some issues like such kind of sparkles and mm -hmm. the color edge issues. Mm -hmm. uh, so we use a very smart way mm -hmm. to handle that. Mm -hmm. For instance, and we use we reuse the blue lasers mm -hmm. of the RGB uh, chipset, mm -hmm. and uh, we use the blue lasers mm -hmm. to stimulate the mm -hmm. uh, green mm -hmm. uh, phosphor light source. Mm -hmm. Then combine the green light, mm -hmm. um, green phosphor light source mm -hmm. with the uh, original green lasers mm -hmm. light source, mm -hmm. then we can get a comfortable light source. So the interesting thing too was the phosphor wheel. It's got holes in it, so I guess part of the phosphor wheel allows, um, converts it to green and the other part allows blue to pass through? They really well rotate, yes. Okay. Yeah. So uh, that is how we uh, optimize the sparkles mm -hmm. issues and mm -hmm. the color edge issues. Mm -hmm. So with that we can get uh, the high bright lace, high mm -hmm. contrast, and uh, the color, high cr color uh, accuracy mm -hmm. and eye comfort mm -hmm. at the same time. So by using this new version of dual yes. light, it's about 30% brighter yeah. than what was found in the Ultra, which we love, right? Yeah. Plus it also has uh, the ability to generate a wider color gamut. Yes. So you get a wider color gamut, yeah. you get 30% more brightness in a package that's about the same size as the original piece. Now there's a lot of other cool functionality things that are in here, but it, but the light sources would really would really stood out to me, which is why if you look in front, you have so many awards yes. for for pushing yeah. for pushing the envelope. Yeah. When I first saw the Horizon Ultra, you were proud that it was one of the first standard throw 
type projector that supported Dolby Vision. Yeah. And that was a big deal. Yeah. And this is now the first smart yeah. long throw projector that supports yes. IMAX enhanced, yes. right? Yeah. Get this certification is a lot, uh, uh, it's a lot easy. And part with our optical technologies and uh, we do that mm -hmm. and we did that. Mm -hmm. We get the certifications, mm -hmm. uh, it's not easy. Mm -hmm. And um, so, so I, I hope um, the users will enjoy our yeah. product. So, yeah, so let's yeah. talk about it. One of the demos you're doing here is you have another um, IMAX enhanced from a competitor yeah. here yes. uh, and you're comparing the two yes. and the the color accuracy is very similar yeah. but the brightness and yeah. the saturation is noticeably better on this. Yes, maybe better. Now, yeah. now normally I, IMAX enhanced projectors are, are quite expensive. About five thousand dollars, mm -hmm. yes, but maybe the new product will be below three thousand dollars. Yeah. So high brightness, wide color gamut, Yes. None of the problems of a traditional yeah. tricolor laser projector with uh, Dolby Vision yes. and um, IMAX enhanced. IMAX enhanced. Yes. Yeah. So, as, so you can see why um, I'm completely excited about the uh, Xdemi Horizon Max. Yes. So um, I'm curious to see, Kevin, what you're going to be coming up with next. Oh, okay, uh, that's a secret, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully next show you'll come with something else that's absolutely okay, amazing, okay, and no I'm problem. I'm actually looking forward to it. Okay. Okay. So, so Kevin, thank you for for coming and talking to me. Okay. So, to learn more about the Xjimi um, Horizon Max, check out yeah. Xjimi. Dot com and check out our reviews of the prior Xjimi products, including the um, the Xjimi Horizon Ultra, which we actually think is the best lifestyle projector on the market today. So, so take care, everyone, and we will talk to you next show. Okay, thank you, everyone. Bye.